find the net change. So we have f of x equals 3x plus 2 from x equals 1 to x equals 4. So to do net change, all it is is the function value of your larger number of x minus the function value for your smaller number of x. And that's it. So it's kind of like slope formula where it's y minus y over x minus x, but you're only looking at the top, the y minus y. So to do this one, we're going to plug the 4 in for f of x, which would be 3 times 4 plus 2. So that's that piece minus, and then f of 1 is just plugging 1 in for x. 3 times 4 is 12 plus 2 is 14 minus, and 3 times 1 is 3 plus 2 is 5. So 14 minus 5 is 9, and we can check it, and the answer is 9. So that's how to do these net change problems. I have notes right here. Net change from the point x1, y1 to x2, y2 is just y2 minus y1. Or you can also think of it as f of the second value. If this is a and b, f of b minus f of a. These all mean the same thing. If you want to try more of these, I have a page online. So here's the page right here. I'll include a link down below in the description, but there's more practice problems you can try out for net change. There's also some notes and there's related pages for other topics you could go over. Please like this video and subscribe to my channel. Comment below if you have any other stuff you want me to try to make a video on. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Andy Bath.